We are Naya. Coach, welcome to Tel Tel Television. Thank you. Yes. Um, we are going. We're almost going into the second leg of the of the of the league. Uh, in the first uh, first phase of the league, you had problems with the playing unit because you just you are using a, a junior team. Tell our viewers what have you done to improve? Have you done any improvements in no, the team? I, I... At, at the beginning, I didn't expect to lose uh, 16 uh, players because it was not uh, what, we, uh, what we to told uh, before. So, so I was uh, I was surprised, and we lost uh, all our key players. So uh, we had to to begin the season with uh, with young players, you know. Yeah. And uh, they, they need to know my philosophy. So, so uh, we uh, we had to to work a, a lot. We did it, and uh, to be honest with you, all these young players are improving a lot. Uh, but you know, when you have uh, when you lack experience, yeah. you, you also have uh, inconsistent uh, results. And that's that's for sure. But uh, they are they are learning. They are learning and they are they are improving. So yeah. now I hope that uh, we will have a few few more players uh, uh, with us uh, in the in the next uh, days. Like that, we could have a team uh, much more balanced and, uh, and a little bit more experimented. Which which, which areas are you looking to uh, to, to improve? You know, we, we, we try to to improve each area. We need some defenders. We need midfielders, and we need uh, we need strikers. You know. Uh, uh, before losing these 18 players, uh, I was expecting to play for the title. But for right now, it will be, uh, I think, uh, I impossible due, due, due to this uh, uh, this FIFA case, and, and, and uh, it took a long time. Yeah. But, but I'm sure if we keep uh, working like, like that for next season, we, we we will be we will be in the top three. But that, with, the, with those players, huh? but we need to keep the, the players we have now. I don't want at the end of the season to lose some more players because we are working with them. Yeah. But uh, in spite of uh, losing 18 players, what you've done it was is actually um, it was not expected. Uh, fans expected the team to be maybe uh, number last. What tricks did you use to no, make sure that you, you, you use you, any tricks? You, you know, it's, it's not about tricks. It's, it's, uh, we are working. We are yeah. working. And, and me, I'm, I'm a coach uh, who, who try to play an attractive football and a modern football. Yeah. Unfortunately, here in Kenya, 90% of the team they are still uh, 30 years uh, uh, behind because it's kick and rush. They don't have any philosophy of building from uh, from behind and, and things like that. So that's what I, I try to teach to, to the players. And, and they are 200% they are in, the, in the same philosophy. So it's, it's, really, uh, it's really important. And then me, I want, I want the fans to come back to the stadium because we are producing an attractive football. You know, sometimes you win, sometimes you, you lose, but we are trying to play football. That's the most important. Coach, that's the kind of uh, 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 message fans want to hear. Are you saying that now Leopard is, is a point where it is almost 30 years ahead of the rest of the, 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 the teams? The quality of football? I, I think, to, to, to be honest with you, I, <laughs> yes. I, I think that we are the team who produce the best football in, uh, in Kenya yeah. with, with, with young players. But because we have a philosophy and we want to play, we don't want to kick the ball like, 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 like stupid teams, you know. Yeah. So, so, so we are on, on this way. So as I told you, uh, having this kind of philosophy, we know that we we, we have a, we have a vision, you know. Yeah. So, 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 so as, as I said, sometimes we can lose uh, some games, of course, but but we are we are playing football, and I think that the fans are, are happy regarding that. Of course, fans also they, they prefer when we when we win, and me me as well. But the most important is to keep this uh, this philosophy. And to, to keep this uh, this vision, it's really important for the improvement of football in Kenya and especially in IFC Leopard. Yeah. Compare what you have, what the, your experience here, and where, where you are at Simba Simba Sports Club in uh, Tanzania. What are the similarities? What are the differences? It's a lot of differences because uh, you know here I think the the problem it's this community club you know yeah, so yeah. so that's a problem that's a problem because uh, you cannot uh, you cannot always expect from uh, from people and from fans i think we need to be much more professional professional and yeah. we have to we need to have a, a business plan we need to have a sponsors and, and things like that so i think for gomaya it's the same but the community club is not it's not the, the it's not the right thing to to improve and to to be a professional so i think this kind of statute needs to change coach i would want to differ with you if you look at 
attract the most successful uh, teams in the, in the world. Our community clubs, look at Barcelona, look, uh, look at Real Madrid, look at Manchester United. Yes, but you, I think you, uh, no, 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 you cannot compare because all these teams they have uh, they have uh, members or board members uh, or sponsorship with big big money. He, here we're struggling uh, every week, yes. every week. So 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 you you really cannot compare this, this kind of clubs and and IFC Leopards. So me, I think that uh, if IFC Leopards wants to 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 be like uh, before and 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 to 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 be glorious. Uh, uh, again, a lot of things need to change. A lot yes. of things need to change. Some of the things that you would want to see changing are like what? A lot of things. See, you, we are training uh, here. We don't have our own uh, facilities. Yeah. Uh, we're training on an artificial pitch. We don't have a, 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 a normal pitch to, to, to train. We have problems with, with some presentation. You know, uh, <laughs> see, if you want players to give 100% of, of, of the pitch during the game, they need to feel comfortable. They need not to have some problems. Some of them, unfortunately, don't have money for breakfast and things like that. So it's really important. Yeah. So that's small, small details, but you know, big. Football, uh, professional football, it's about the details. Yeah, actually, you are talking about almost total lack of motivation for for the players. No, no, they, 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 are, they, are, they are here. You know, you know, with all the problems they, they have, they are on the pitch. They don't miss training. They are here, so it's really, really uh, important. As soon as, as I told them, we have all of us, we have problems. Okay, but yeah. as soon as we come on the pitch, we need to forget these problems for for one hour thirty or two hours, yeah. and after just thinking football, and that's what they are doing. And to be honest, I'm very proud of them regarding that yeah uh, the, the fans would be very, very interested in knowing um, you talked about the goalkeeping department that had problems uh, any additions as we go into the second uh, second leg? No, I didn't say that uh, we had a goalkeeper the, pro pro the, problem. What, what you had in the... You know, yes. the, the, the difference between this year and, and last season, last season we had, uh, uh, I will say, two number one uh, with Oyemba and, uh, and, uh, and Ochan, you know? Yeah. And now the, the, our goalkeeper at the beginning of the season was Maxwell. Yes. Maxwell was fourth goalkeeper last season. So we, we, we bring in uh, uh, Levis. Okay. So now I think that it's not a good compartment that we need to absolutely to have, to have players. We need strikers because we have this problem. So I hope that uh, some players are, are training with us. I hope that uh, everything will be all right for, for, for them to join us. Yeah. But I don't know. But yeah. I don't know. And um, what is uh, your view of Kenya going forward at, at, at an individual level? You know, to, to, to be honest with you, I think they have good players in, in Kenya. They are good players. Now, regarding the way to play, it comes also from the philosophy of the coach. And yeah. I think that the Kenyan football, I, I know it's similar to uh, in English football from uh, 30 years ago, but English football <laughs> improved. Yeah. Kenyan football stay at the same level. It's long ball, kick and rush, yeah. and, and, and they don't play. So, so I really think that they need to change this uh, philosophy because you have good players here. Yeah. And, 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 you, and we need to take 100% uh, of these players. Unfortunately, I think that some, some coaches are only using players to 20% of the of the skill. I talk about uh, refereeing, the, the standard of refereeing in Kenya. In the past, I've heard you complain about drawing matches or losing matches you shouldn't have lost. You know, it's not only me who is complaining about referees. All the coaches are, are, are complaining. So. When it's one or two guys who are complaining, you can say, oh, these guys are, are, are crazy. But when yeah. everybody is complaining about referee, we know that the, the key point is the officiating. Uh, and uh, uh, to be honest with you, I don't want to talk too much re re regarding that. But from the beginning, so it's now one year I'm here, yeah. I think that the best referee I have seen is a woman. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, where do you think is the problem? Could it be as, as a result of um, a lack of knowledge, or there have been in the past two years there have been allegations of much, much fixing in Kenya? I, I think the problem is that yep, much fixing. I think so. Yeah. I, I'm not sure, but I think so because you you see things so so evident that uh, you can expect something different. Or, 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 or the level is maybe too high for some uh, for some of them, but uh, unfortunately there are a lot of uh, allegations. So is it true? Is it not true? That uh, I don't know, but it, it, it's a possibility. Yes. Talk about your, uh, your captain Marvin. He has been doing a, a wonderful job in spite of his age. What is your rating of him? You know, I don't like to talk to. Uh, He's your captain. The player is my captain. He is the captain of the team, and I, yeah. I wanted to give him this responsibility because he's also a technical leader on the pitch. But Marvin is, is, uh, is shy, I would say. So, so I want him to. to, to 
to be the captain, to, to talk, to shout. Uh, it comes little by, by, by little, but uh, I'm, 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 I'm happy uh, uh, about uh, his performance, like the performance of the others. I tell you, since one year I'm, I'm here, all players improve a lot. So, so it's, it's really important and they are young players, so it's a good thing. Uh, actually, what, what they, uh, they talk about here is um, they have some, somebody, a father figure, they always feel very comfortable with. Was it deliberate or it is actually just attitude? No, I think that, you know, you you play like you train. Yes. And when you train well, of course, you see that on, on, on the pitch during during the game. So so uh, I, I repeat, every day they are running a little, a little, a little. So I'm sure if we can keep this group of players, plus three or, or four uh, new new players, and we, if we can keep them for, for, for two or three years, I'm sure that Leopa will be champion. Yes. Um, at what step, uh, what will be your achievement at the end of um, at the end of the the, the, the league this the season? You know, Do you expect to be in a, among the top five. To, to be honest with you, we start on, on a wrong uh, foot regarding as well all the players we we, we lost. So so, so uh, it, it's it takes time to 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 uh, to make a group improving. You know. Yeah. So so now I, I think that if we can have these, these players, we will just need to take a, a, a match at a time and to try every weekend to 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 go a little bit higher and higher and. Higher. I don't want to talk about top eight or top six or top three. Let's let's keep uh, playing football, enjoying fans and uh, uh, scoring goals and having victories. But uh, looking at you, the, the passion with which you talk, the passion with which you, you, you coach, even when you're on the field, it wouldn't come as a surprise if you won the league. It wouldn't surprise you if you emerged uh, top. You, you know, you know me. I, I think that we, if we have these players, we will. We will be a, a, a team difficult to beat, you know, uh, because already now, as I said, we are we are playing football. So if we can have some uh, some improvement in each uh, in each uh, compartment, I, I think we 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 can make a, a, a long uh, row of uh, of uh, success. Success, I think so. Okay, viewers, we've been talking to AFC Leopards coach Peter Oze Ozems. Until the uh, next time. He's, he's, he's tired, he's been training the player, uh, leading the training. Let's give him a break to, to go and rest.